humans are using fresh water resources at a faster rate than they are being replenished. An estimated 884 million people across the globe lack clean drinking water. A full 2.5 billion want for adequate sanitation. Most recently, the water crisis has hit home in the form of devastating droughts parching major portions of the western United States, resulting in draconian water restrictions for municipalities, businesses, and private customers alike. Our planet is crying out for a wiser use of our precious water resources. Yet, every year, millions of gallons of lightly used gray water from laundries and showers continue to flow down the drain. Among the biggest users are large commercial, governmental, and educational facilities such as hotels, prisons, hospitals, apartments, and college dormitories. How much water? Consider this. Keeping just one person clean is a big job, and our scarce water resources bear the brunt. We soak in our showers. We bask in our baths. We linger while washing our hands. And too many of us let the tap run while brushing our teeth. Not to mention doing all that laundry for all those different outfits. It really adds up. Over the course of just one year, a single person can run through more than 14,000 gallons of water, just keeping clean. Now is the time to come clean when it comes to gray water from our shower and laundry uses. Unlike so-called black water from toileting uses, the gray water from these sources is lightly used, so it simply doesn't make sense to let it go down the drain. By processing and recycling gray water, millions of gallons a day can be reused for non-potable applications, everything from toileting to agriculture, and including reuse for laundry. Introducing the System for Laundry and Shower Recycle Reuse, or Silas R2, designed and developed by Concurrent Technologies Corporation, CTC. CTC's Silas R2 employs a three-stage temperature-tolerant filtration sequence. It incorporates separation media not traditionally used in water filtration and uses customized control logic to optimize backwash recirculation and increase the overall processing rate. Finally, a unique energy recovery device at the reverse osmosis filtration stage dramatically reduces the system's overall energy consumption. These features and more combine to create a first-of-its-kind, energy-efficient, scalable, and fully automated gray water processing and reuse system that requires little to no maintenance and uses few consumable inputs or parts. The result is a groundbreaking decentralized system capable of recovering 90% plus of an operation's wastewater from laundry and shower uses. Wasting millions of gallons of gray water annually is the dirty little secret of keeping clean. But it doesn't have to be this way. CTC's Silas R2 can make coming clean both environmentally friendly and economically sensible. Originally developed to solve a real-world problem for the Department of Defense, namely reducing water resupply needs at forward operating bases, the Silas R2 technology was transitioned to the U.S. Air Force in 2015. Based on this initial success and its broad applications, CTC is collaborating with a national hotel developer intent on incorporating our laundry gray water reuse system into designs for a hotel currently under construction. Broad implementation of Silas R2 across various gray water intensive industries would accelerate compliance with stricter water reuse mandates, achieve cost savings from reduced water and sewage utilization, and meet our moral obligation to become better stewards of our always precious but increasingly scarce water resources. This is most urgently the case in drought-stricken regions in the U.S. and across the rest of the world. As a nonprofit company working in the interests of the public good, CTC is committed to ensuring and safeguarding water resources for current and future generations. CTC's innovative technological breakthrough to sensibly, sustainably, and cost-effectively process, recycle, and reuse gray water from large-scale laundry and shower operations helps achieve this sacred trust today, so our precious water resources will be there for many tomorrows to come. The water may be gray, but the future is clear.